Welcome to Professor Jeff's videos on learning. Today, I will answer the following question in two minutes. What is learning? Learning is a change in knowledge, skills, or behavior resulting from experience. Let's analyze the three components of this classic definition. The change produced by learning can be divided into three parts. First, you sense your environment, then you adapt your response, and finally, you record the experience. Sensing your environment means feeling a gap between your past experiences and your current situation, and such a gap must exist for learning to occur. Adapting your response means integrating new information into past learning and this ability to give meaning to new information through association and inference must exist for learning to occur. Recording the experience means repeating the new connection enough times so that you can use it in the future and this ability to use a new connection more than once must exist for learning to occur. So learning is all about creating and strengthening connections and this is clear when we look at the brain. In a lifetime, learning creates between 100 and 1,000 trillion intercellular connections. So we can say that learning is happening almost all the time. Now, let's have a look at the second part of our definition. The famous educational psychologist Benjamin Bloom described three types or three domains of learning, namely the cognitive, psychomotor, and affective domains. In other words, we can change what we know, what we do, and what we feel. Finally, Let's take a quick look at the third element of our definition. Experience is what differentiates the change generated by learning from any other types of changes, such as biological development. So for learning to occur, the change must come from an interaction with your environment. In one word, learning is adapting from previous experiences. Thank you for watching this presentation, and see you soon.